good evening welcome to our channel you she talks and today we are talking about panther burn cottage who owns it and why is there an outrage over airbnb triple listing of 1833 slave cabin we have more details please continue to watch this video airbnb on monday removed the listing of an 1830s uh, slave cabin from the rental site after a tiktok video about the property sparked outrage after remo removing the panther burn cottage located at on belmont plantation in greenville mississippi airbnb issued an apology properties that formerly housed the enslaved I have no place on Airbnb. We apologize for any trauma or grief caused by the presence of this listing and others like it and that we did not act sooner to address the issue, said uh, Airbnb in a statement. It further mentioned that the company is working hard with the experts to formulate policies that will combat such listings in future. So who owns Panther Burn Cottage? Brad Hosser has been the owner of Panther Burn Cottage for only three weeks. Hosser issued a statement saying, as the new three-week owner of the Belmont in Greenville, Mississippi, I apologize for the decision to provide our guests a stay at the slave quarters behind the 1857 antebellum home that is now a bed and breakfast place. I also apologize for insulting African Americans whose ancestors were slaves. He explained that the property was previously owned by Joshua B. Kane, who advertised the place as such. Also continued that he strongly opposed the previous owner's decision to market the building as a place where slaves once slept after toiling in the cotton fields in human bondage. He said that the listing was a leftover from Kane, who had locked him out of social media, the property rentals account till TikTok video went viral. So how did the video went viral? The video was posted by Winter Yates, a black lawyer hailing from New Orleans, who said in the video, how is this okay in somebody's mind to rent this out? A place where human beings were kept as slaves, rent this out as bed and breakfast. Yates shared a series of screenshots, which included the description of the property and the average rating with 68 reviews and a 4.97 rating. So uh, he continued to say the history of slavery in this country is constantly denied and now it's being mocked by being turned into a luxurious vacation spot. He explained that his brother first pointed out the property in the hopes of renting it, but Yates felt compelled to call it out. As the description in the screenshot shared by Winton Yates, the Panther Burn is an 1830s slave cabin from the extant Panther Burn plantation to the south of Belmont. It has also been used as a tenant sharecropper's cabin and a medical office for local farmers and their families to visit the plantation doctor. That's all we have in today's video. Please continue to watch this space for more informative news. Thanks for watching us. You have a wonderful day ahead. Bye-bye.